Well, hello. Welcome to uh, the first video of uh, 30 minutes with. Or I might change that to a half hour with. Or I might change it to something else. It's basically going to be a series where it will be me, MG Ace Man, or Ace Man, or whatever uh, name you think I go by. I used to go by Ace Man, but everybody on Twitter and kind of my new sort of more now name name is M M for mother or sort of like mental G for gamers Aceman M G Aceman anyway enough of that here I am or should I say here's my Sims 3 character who is a 5 star celebrity um I've got some lifetime rewards and there are plenty of others uh, that I could collect. Um, there are some I, I kind of noticed a little earlier but in like, when I was playing before. There's this clown voucher where you can have a clown of yourself as a child and it will join your household. That's a new one. <laughs> and the thing is, it's not as if I've even like got any new content. The only new things since the very last time I played is town life stuff. Um, the only things that I haven't got is Sims 3 Pets, Master Sweet stuff, Sims 3 Showtime, and Katy Perry's sweet treats. I've got everything else except those. And actually, a little bit later, I think I might be buying uh, Sims 3 pets and Master Sweet stuff because they're on offer on Origin at the moment. So uh, yeah, I might be buying them through there. I normally buy my expansions on disc because I prefer them that way. But if it's going to work out cheaper for the digital download. Which I would do that anyway, I would just register the game on Origin and download it then. I think I might just buy it through there anyway. So anyway, th that's all I've got. I've got everything except for those four things. Uh, so, this Clown Voucher, uh, Motive Mobile, that's a new, another new one I haven't seen. Uh, Extra Creative, I'm not sure if I've seen that one before. Uh, Super Nanny, I can't remember seeing that one before. Uh, you know, like I say, all I've got is the town love stuff. And the, some of these were here before I installed that just like a few hours ago. Uh, I really have you know, no idea where they came from because although the game is up to date, I'm, it's not the kind of things that get updated. Okay, uh, what I'm going to be doing now is basically changing my Sims appearance because he kind of looks a bit of a douche at the moment. Uh, th this was a, an, an earlier Sim Sashko. that I created and uh, yeah, yeah, I've got the old soul patch thing going on there and uh, you know, the hair's kind of not quite so. Uh, mm. So, if we go to hair, there could be. S ah, there's a new one because that's part of the town life stuff. So, if we look at that one, I'll look even more of a douche. Yeah. I'm totally. 
coffee beaver crap type there, there. Jeez, I'm not having that. Uh, let me see. Uh, da, 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 da. That one is kind of funky. Um, oh, so according to that, that is the only one that you get with turn off stuff. Okay. Um, I mean, I want something that's just nice, normal, no, you know, no sort of special weird one like that, you know, I mean, that kind of thing. You think you're in like Dragon Ball Z or something? It's over 9,000! <laughs> so, uh, <coughs> yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, yeah, I, I'm guessing that's kind of what the, the Guido look is. So, yeah, I don't want to look a complete douche, just to uh, get rid of that one. Oh, that one, yeah, that looks completely stupid. I'm guessing that's kind of a mad professor type look if you colour it. Uh, like that. Yeah. Oh my god, Marty! We need to get back to the future! Um, let's see, I mean, there's nothing really kind of want. Let's get back to my own. Oh, there, cool. I mean, that, that looks, that's kind of a type perm type of thing, so I mean, now. Uh, you got that one which is uh, a bit of a doosh type of <laughs> of last uh, one. Yeah, I don't think so. So, so uh, yeah, I'm guessing the only kind of normal-ish one that I like is. Uh, yeah, go on, we'll go with that one. Kind of, uh, what's his name? You know, the guy from Chase, Nathan Fillion type look. There. <laughs> uh, facial hair. Um, this is one thing that hasn't really been worked on, and I'm not really sure if you can buy that much from the store. I mean, you've got one like that, which. Yeah. Uh, mm, no. Oh, sure. Where did that one come from? Because that is pretty much the one, I, the one I'm looking for. Although I would prefer it if it was a little bit lighter. Uh, Let's try that now. It's still a bit dark. Um, hmm. I guess you've got to kind of uh, mess around with the different. Uh, ah, right, roots. Uh, if you have the roots dark like so, and then kind of get in uh, gradually lighter like, like that, is that um, let's see. that there? Yeah, well. No, I'm not going to spend too much time messing about. No, it's, uh, it's not something I like to faff about with that much. So, uh, uh, body hair. Since when could you have body hair? Wow! Bam! Pitch! Pow! Pow! Pitch! 
Uh, yeah, should we go for that? Just the light. Uh, oh no, you can have back hair as well. Seriously. <laughs> yeah, uh, can you. No, oh my god, you can have back hair. Ah. Uh, really? <laughs> uh, what's it? Is this, is this supposed to be leg hair or, or what? Oh, no, man. Oh, it's supposed to be arm, arm hair. Jeez, it could be like Robin Williams, couldn't it? <laughs> Not Robbie Williams, Robin Williams, you know, the uh, Jumanji. Um, wow. <laughs> Yeah, I'm saying, I mean, I'm acting all surprised and stuff, but you know what, it's, it's good. I don't think, things like this, it's, uh, oh my, ha, I assure you, I do not have some kind of pre-build of The Sims 3 Supernatural. <laughs> this, this is, uh, Ooh, that's ooh, that's nasty. That was okay. I mean, come on, guys have yeah you know, body hair, so yeah, that's not so bad. Yeah, guys do have back hair. Real guys, not these poses that you know. Let's uh. Get the cells waxed and whatever. So. Brunard Dar. Brunard Dar. And that will do. Looks better than before, anyway. And as we wait for it to load. Mm. Well, as you can see, that's one part of the game that uh, You can uh, do it. This is annoying, this thing up here. Create a new post. No, let me just play my game. Go away. Uh, opportunities. Right, okay. Learn the photography skill. Eat at restaurants. Ah, oh, the painting thing. Um, yeah, I need to. No. To do that, and then uh, take painting, and uh, add it to the collection of which I will need to take to uh, City Hall. Yes. Ah, there we go. Look, one of five paintings. Okay, there we go. Uh, here's my inventory, which is just general crap. <laughs> like everybody does, you know, you just pick up any old rubbish. Um, skills. I'm pretty skilled in a lot of stuff, but there's still some things like writing and. What's that one? Fishing. I'm still quite low in. Uh, my career is a dynamic DNA profiler. Which, uh, I don't think is quite the top of the, uh, the career ladder, but it's kind of getting there, so. Uh, relationships. Well, there we go. Zel oh, jeez. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Zelda May is married to the Ace Man Sim that I made before. Uh, because the Ace Man Sim that I'm playing with now, he was, well, like I say, because of 
the game was glitched before I couldn't do something, I forgot what it was. And I thought, right, I know, if I decide to uh, create another scene, and maybe I can do whatever it was. I think it's something to do with uh, the invention thing. Um, yeah, I know that there's there's something anyway that's uh <laughs> where the game was glitched and so anyway. Uh household, friends, visitors, work, da da da. Um, a simology. There we go. Chakar. Jimmy Chakar. Chakar <laughs> Celebrity <laughs> Journal. That's kind of my uh, thing. <laughs> oh, thing. Um, these are a few pictures of well, no, just random events <laughs> when stuff happens. <laughs> uh, statistics, blah 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 blah. Um, a biography, yeah, never bothered to put anything there, so anyway. Uh, family tree, it's just me. Ah, there you go, look, so here's my needs and stuff. I'll be needing to go to bed pretty soon because, uh, actually, there's no work, is it, tomorrow? Because today. It's Tuesday. Tomorrow will be Wednesday, and so a day off. Okay. Uh, what have we got there? Become good friends. Work out for ten hours straight. Level like gardening skill. Master painting skill, which I'm pretty close to doing. Uh, I think um, I'm, I'm basically almost there with mastering the painting skill, so that one will, will be fulfilled. Um, if we take a look at the map, as you can see there are things, that's where I've got to deliver the paintings, that's the, uh, the chess tournament, photo evidence, that's where I need to uh, to learn the photography skill and send some photos, and that's another one where I need to eat. Um, oh, at the moment I could just go and collect some money. Cardo, Jill, huh? Huh? What? Just go. <laughs> Alrighty. God's got me some money, man. So, uh, yeah, I'm in at the moment of recording this. Uh, Origin are having a 50% sale. And I'll tell you what, it's blooming good value. If you, do, if, if you buy The Sims game on its own, at the moment... Okay. Uh, not a. Um, if you buy the Sims game on the time, it's like 30 quid. If you buy the Sims game with an expansion, such as if you bought. You can buy the Sims 3. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> the Sims 3 and uh, Sims 3 pets. You can buy both, and it works out at something like £22.49. Which you think, uh, I'll done a minute. Well, that works out cheaper than the game itself. Yes, it does. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Uh, anyway, that's... Uh, that's that. I've collected some money from there. Uh, if we go 
back up to the map mode. Um, let's see. Because you've got that which is that, then you've got that which is that still, blah 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 blah. Um, here we go, let's collect some more money from there. And so, at the, at the time of recording this, yeah, there's uh, a good sale on The Sims 3 stuff on Origin. Now I know, you know, oh god, it's Origin, what the hell, man, no way, whatever. And I've got to be honest, I pretty much hate the thing myself. I've had serious problems with it lately. Uh, wrong login, wrong password, wrong... Everything, yeah. you know, it was like, uh, hello. I mean, I couldn't even log in into The Sims 3, <laughs> into the game, you know, to take advantage of blah 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 blah. Um, so yeah, I've, I've kind of had my problems with it today. I was venting a little on Twitter earlier on, and you know. Uh, asking you know, why, when I want to verify my email, do you send an email without a link to click to verify my email? So I've kind of got a. Oh, uh, and anyway, so uh, that's the diner, by the way. At the moment, it's owned by Zelda May. I think. Hogan's Deep Fried Diner. Yeah, I think it's... The Town Boy Zelda May, which is the first Iceman uh, Sims wife. So. And her career is basically a rock star. So, anyway. At the moment, let's uh, just get back home and... Go to bed. Why not? One of the most enthralling things ever. That's another thing as well. Oh, did I mention... Uh, uh, I mean, this is one of the funky beds there. But did I mentioned in the life, Lifetime Rewards, uh, you can actually buy... A hover bed. Ground bound beds are a thing of the past. Purchase this reward to receive the state of the art in hovering slumber satisfaction. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. really have no idea. Uh, what's that, uh, what that's about and. Uh, and whatever. So, anyway. As you can see, uh, this is my Sims game. Um, the reason I picked uh, the career that I did, which is, I mean, as you can see, I've reached the lifetime wish there. Uh, it's one of the best ones because you get 30,000 lifetime happiness points. Uh, and, and all you've got to do is just reach level 10 in the law enforcement career track. And But once you get to a certain point, you do need to go into the forensics branch rather than the other way. So. Um, I'll show you my other stuff. Um, and as you can see, yeah, this is one of the most exciting parts of the game. Watching your sim sleep. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, the furniture I've got here is it's all kind of the same um, same stuff. Um, 
view, view my map, um, view my home, ta da da, <laughs> um, buy mode. Uh, let's see, because dishwashers. See, these are the things that actually cost simpons. Simpons are the things you can actually buy for money to purchase things for in the game. Now, that Swish dishwasher, or Primo Deluxe dishwasher, is the kind that you can buy with money you earn in the game, such as... Now, oh, I've got 86,055 simoleons. I could buy those. These cost sim points, which is what you buy with actual money. That's the difference, you know. You know, you got that, which is a bit of a special thing there. Uh, so see that, that one there, that, that's from a certain... I think that's from the outdoor stuff pack. Because, as you can see, it looks like it's on bricks or something like that. So, uh, disposal. See, I mean, you've got these kind of things. This is kind of what's a bit wrong with the game. You know, you, the fact that you've got this kind of stuff. If you want custom content, you should be able to just download it and add it to your game. Rather than spend actual money. And, you know buy stuff. I mean, such as that uh, Lord of Vladimir's Magic Cauldron. No, I don't want that, thank you very much. Um, you know, bathroom stuff such as uh, showers. Um, the not-so-routine machine. Yeah, you might think, wow, yeah. But it costs sim points. That's what you need to remember. This one just costs... Damn it. <laughs> this one just costs simoleons. As in, what you buy. Yeah, so. uh, that's one thing you need to remember. Uh, beds, say you, you've got that sharper... Sharper sim super sleeper. Uh, as good as they may look, they cost 400 sim points, which, as I will say just once more, you buy with real money. At, uh, at uh, like online or whatever, you know. Um, and then there are plenty of other good beds, that are, you know, such as that one. Yeah, it's rather, uh, rather funky, isn't it? Or the Great Wall Bed. Yeah, so you don't really need to be spending valuable sim points on frivolous items. Uh, you got the build modes, which I'm sure like most people have seen. You know, for example, if I wanted to. Uh, If we put the walls up, then we can say, uh, if you want to turn this bit into a, a room, rather than it be, I think it's actually a, a sloped roof. But what you could do is literally get rid of that roof and then turn this wall into proper walls instead of these uh, like triangle. Thing. So there you could actually make the room smaller or bigger and blah blah so uh, there's collections from different things fast lane stuff ambitions town life stuff see that's uh, all the kind of stuff that you get there well this is kind of a good idea really to uh, uh, these are lots actually. See, that's a, a fresh... Uh, see, so you, you can't put it on there, so... 
Um, with these, you need to buy a lot and put it on there, and you can basically own, own your own shop or two. You know, depending on how big the lot is, you could put like two or even all three on there. So, yeah, that's that. So, uh, anyway, uh, I hope you've enjoyed this uh, sort of half hour of The Sims 3 with me. And uh, hopefully, I will. Well, I'll say I'll see you next time. I hope you will join me again in a, another of these videos. Um, where I will show you 30 minutes of a game that you don't normally see in a demo. So, um, thanks for watching, and goodbye until next time.